So the Nintendo Switch is now officially one year old. It was exactly 365 days ago when the Switch came out. And in that time, Nintendo has done an incredible job of taking what went wrong with the Wii U and perfecting it. In the past year alone, there has been so many great third party and first party games on the Switch that you could have never imagined on the Wii U. Some of the best third party titles on the Switch that I can mention off the top of my head are games like Doom, Skyrim, and Wolfenstein 2. And then when you look at the first party side, you got games like Super Mario Odyssey, The Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. And then when you look at the future, there is so many hope for new games. We got Metroid Prime 4, Pokemon, and countless other IPs that are coming to the Switch. I even made a video with Switch Top talking about what we think is going to be at E3 2018. And we talk a lot about games that Nintendo is going to show off. And if Nintendo does show off everything that we talked about, the Switch is going to have a great 2018. But for me, just the idea of the Nintendo Switch being one year old is really shocking because the Nintendo Switch does not feel that old. Like, it just feels like I picked it up maybe three months ago. And attached to that is a lot of great memories I have with it. Even in the last year, I've had so many memories that I just can't place in any other console. And attached to that is a lot of fantastic memories. Like, I have memories of my Nintendo Switch in my last year alone with it that's it just can't be attached to any other console. When I first picked up my Switch on March 5th of 2018, I was just, there was just this special feeling about it. Like, the games too, like just having this huge game like Breath of the Wild on a tiny cartridge and then putting it into your Switch and just playing it with you, there's like a charm to it that can't be matched by anything else. I'm sure you felt that before with anything, like whether it be a console or any product. I felt it with my Wii U, my 360, and plenty of other consoles, but the Switch has a, f a charm that literally just outmatches everything. It may be hard to compare them, but the Switch is just such a great console because, for me, I have so many great memories with it. So let's stop looking at the past. Let's look at the future. Now, the future for the Switch is quite hazy because recently Nintendo hasn't really done much and I'm talking about in the first little bit of 2018. We haven't gotten any big announcements, all we've gotten is Bayonetta 3 and some smaller indie titles, nothing really too big. Like I said with my E3 2018 video with Switch Stop, I think that Nintendo could look at the Switch and just say, wow, we can make this something big. And by big, I mean taking everything great about Nintendo consoles and shoving it into one console. If you like traditional experiences, just take the Switch, put it in the dock. If you're a portable lover, go portable. Just take the Switch out of the dock and just play it wherever you want. And maybe in a couple years we'll be saying like, wow, hey, do you want to play the new Star Fox game and the new Metroid game and maybe even the new Galaxy 3 or whatever? Maybe even like a new Mario Maker? I have no idea. And just say, hey, you want to take these games on the go? Because, you know, these are some great AAA experiences. You want to play them? Like, you can't do that with any other console. Now, there is some exceptions. There was some consoles that were kind of, sort of, like the Switch in the past. An example of another console maker that did something sort of similar is actually Sega with their Nomad console. Which, if you don't know that, I highly recommend you check out a gaming historian video on that because he did a great job explaining it. It's basically like a portable, a portable Sega Genesis that could hook up to a TV. And it's kind of like a Switch, but I just, there hasn't been any other console that's been truly like the Switch. And that's why I think Nintendo's gonna hit it out of the park with this generation of consoles. Because there's never been a Nintendo console that's sold this well, so fast. And there's never been a Nintendo console that's literally just this good in my opinion. But what are your memories with the Switch? Let me know them in the comments. I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, then I would appreciate it if you shared this video on social media. But it's always up to you. And if you want to check out my social medias, which I'm starting to be more active on Twitter and Discord. So I highly recommend you check those out. I'll have those linked in the description. And see you.